Hello everybody. Today we're going to be installing Portainer Community Edition. If you don't know what Portainer is, it's a software platform that allows you to manage your Docker environment, including all the containers and the volumes um, and networks. So the first thing that we're going to do is remote into our machine with Docker installed. Verify that Docker is running. All right. Deploying Pertainer is actually pretty easy. All you've got to do is your basic Docker run command, and you've also got to create a volume. So we're going to create the volume first. I'm going to name it Pertainer Data. And now we're going to type in our Docker run command. These commands will be in the description below. That way you can just copy them into your terminal. So what this command does is it exposes ports 8,000 and 9,000 on your Docker machine. Um, it names the container portainer and it will always restart. It creates two volumes. One is just to connect it to the Docker socket on the host machine. And the second is where all of the data is stored for the application. Okay, we're just gonna hit enter. It's gonna pull it from the Docker hub. And there we have it, the container's been deployed. Now we can access it using our browser. We just gotta type in the IP address of the machine and the port number that we exposed. And this is what you see after you create your first user. Um, because this is only a single system and we're just trying to manage the local Docker, Docker environment, we're gonna click Docker, we're gonna hit connect. And there we go. Retainer is running. There's the hello world container we ran when we installed Docker. Um, and there's Portainer. And that's all there is to it. We could start using Portainer to manage our Docker environment. 